Well, greetings Riverside and citizens of California in the United States. It's Thursday, December 3rd, a little after 6 p.m. As of a 11.04 a.m. update in the press enterprise out here in Riverside, our local congressman, Mark Takano, decided with less than a day since the terrorist attacks up in San Bernardino happened, the answer is more gun control. More gun control, more attacks on the Second Amendment. Never mind that the people who attacked the little special needs center in San Bernardino dropped their kid off at their grandma's, you know, saying they were going on a dental visit, you know, going to go to the dentist. Why wouldn't they want to bring the kid with them? Well, that's right, because they were planning ahead. Never mind that these folks uh, just came back from Saudi Arabia. Nah, has nothing to do with it. Never mind, you know, uh, what their motive was, right? Workplace grievance. That's why for workplace grievance, your home needs to be surrounded by the cops. And uh, when there's IEDs found inside, that's just what any normal person does for workplace grievance. And uh, Mark DeCano, that answer for those IEDs is more gun control legislation, more Second Amendment legislation. I mean, we wouldn't want to focus on Obama over in Paris right now looking like a buffoon and uh, everyone pushing climate change as the reason for terrorism. Because that's so credible. Yeah. We don't want to point out that uh, it's alleged that these uh, shooters were using police issue weapons. We don't want to point out that the FBI was on the scene within moments along with the police, which is very rare, especially in the empire. I mean, RPD in my line of work, sometimes they take 45 minutes, you know, sometimes they don't even show up. Sometimes they're there in 15 minutes if I'm lucky. 15 minutes is a lot of time for an active shooter. But you want to say that people need to wait for their guns. They got to wait longer. You want to say that a person who is a lawful registered gun owner needs to jump through more hoops. Mark Takano, you know that I've called your office. I've emailed your staff a few times. You know the people of Riverside are pretty, pretty intelligent. We're pretty on the ball. Do you really think more Second Amendment fixes and, you know, tampering with that? An amendment, you know, in our Constitution, if you really think taking away our rights will make us safer against what was obviously an Islamic extremist jihadist attack, just like in Garland, Texas, just like in Chattanooga at the recruiting stations. Hello, Middle Eastern terrorists attack recruiters of the Iraqi sheriffs and the Iraqi police and the Iraqi army, just like they will do here stateside. And they're going to go through no hoops. In fact, they just might have a hideout with refugees like ISIS said they would last February. Mr. Takano, if you really believe that everyone out here in Riverside is that stupid To follow that train of thought, you don't deserve our vote next November. You don't deserve re-election. So you better think of what you told the press enterprise. You better recant that, retract that, or I'm going to make a point with other people that are out here in Riverside who reluctantly voted you as the best option. (laughs) We're going to throw our support to your opponent. You know, have fun not getting any more money from your lobbyists. Have fun not having the Democratic Party telling you how to earn another paycheck. Because it's clear you were quiet on gun control issues for a while. Now you pop out. You parrot the talking points. You know, I thought you got it. Obviously, I was wrong. I can admit being wrong. And uh, hopefully you can admit you're wrong too. Folks out here in Riverside, we had our concealed carries or if we had weapons on us, I guarantee you, we wouldn't have 14, 13 dead at that place in San Bernardino. We would have taken those guys out. But nobody in this town wants to speak the truth. You look at Garland, Texas, with the Jaw Muhammad contest, the second that little fanatic decided to pull a gun, guess what? He was shot dead in moments. Not a, not a single blurb about that. So, tell you what, folks. All of you out there in Riverside, it's been a long time since Strikers cut a promo. I'm cutting this promo to all of you. Everyone in SoCal, everyone in the United States. You want to make it viral, make it viral. Send it all the way to Obama. Send it all the way to Biden. Send it all the way to your congressmen, your representatives. Those of us who are former military, especially, need to speak out. 
when we swear to protect the Constitution, it's every part of the Constitution, every part. It's not just us picking what one satisfies us. It's the ones that satisfy the whole citizenry. And I guarantee you, every American wants to be able to sleep safe at night in whatever way makes them comfortable, not whatever way makes the Congress comfortable. Let your representatives know. Light up Mark Takano's switchboard. Call that son of a gun. Let him know you disagree with him. You strongly disagree with him. And in fact, I'll make another post. We're going to get this guy's contact number out. We are going to make Mark Takano realize the Elon Empire is pro-Second Amendment. The Elon Empire has common sense. There is no more need to add to what is in our laws. We're in California. We got strict enough laws as it is. Okay? If the laws were any tighter, it'd be like getting blood out of a stone, which it pretty much is at this point. So everybody out there who's awake, wake other people up. Let them know it's time for us to start voting on this guy. It's time for us to let him know we're displeased with him. And more so, let's take our money, the people who want to lobby and take away our constitutional rights, their businesses, let's not do business with them no more. You know, Walmart, McDonald's, they're hurting because of their crappy practices that they give their employees and the public. And now they're learning, you know. Meanwhile, you got places like Costco or Chipotle who are kind of ethical. You guys praise them? You should. Vote with your dollars. Vote wisely. Mark Takano, we'll be waiting to hear what you have to say tomorrow.